podcast. We're going to do a little lab today. Should be uh, fun. You're going to be doing the lab today with this Elodia, which are these plants in this dish. It's an aquarium plant. They're kind of cool. Uh, you'll notice that over here in the lab, you've got pond water, but you also have an area with salt water, and they're labeled. The dishes will be sitting on top of them, so you may have to look through it. Notice that your Elodia is starting in the pond water. So on your paper, you're going to do part A first. How do you know what to do for part A? Oh, that's right, the lab binder. So you're going to flip it open. You are looking for... This lab right here, observing cells in hypertonic and hypotonic solutions. So this for part A. It's going to pull the plant out, grab a leaf, split it in half. You're working in partners, two people per scope, and you're going to split the leaf in half. One person, one group gets this half, the other group gets that half, and then you're looking at it. After you get the leaf for part A, so as you're just going to put that over in the salt water, that way it'll be sitting in the salt water solution. I wonder, is that going to be hypotonic or hypertonic? Either way, it'll be sitting in the salt water solution while you're doing your A. The only sketch you need to make here is on your 400 times. Notice there's only the one circle, so you're just going to do the 400 times. Don't worry, you got to label those organelles. You'll know where the cell membrane is because it'll be pushed really close to the cell wall. So if you have your cell and one of them, obviously you're going to fill the whole area, but one of them looks like this and you just see chloroplasts all around the outside. The cell membrane then is right here, right up against the cell wall, right? So you label cell wall, you label cell membrane just on the inside of it. And then obviously the green things, those will be your chloroplasts. Now if you see something like this, and you see all the chloroplasts are crammed into the middle, and that means the cell wall is still where it was before, but the cell membrane now would be here. When you go to get your leaf for, plant for part B, it'll be the same, except this time you'll be pulling it from the salt water. You pull it from the salt water, split your leaves in half, sherry, sherry, put it back into the regular water, the pond water. Then you'll do part A pretty much again, but this time, after you take your leaf split in half, you'll leave it in the pond water that's ready for part A. So you're going to do part A, part B, part C. High power sketch only, so that's 400 times magnification. Remember, you're going to fill this whole viewing area, but remember that you still need to start on scanning power, work your way through low power before you get to high power, otherwise you're not going to see anything. Go ahead and get to work.